Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be going over the game editions. Are they worth it? And should you buy them? Should be noted, I'm not going to go over the John Wick DLC in this video, but I do have a video on my channel going over that more in depth, and I'll leave a link to that in the description. Without further ado, let's get into it. So what is a game edition? So with a game edition, upon purchasing it, you will receive all of the items included in it, and at the start of every wipe, you will have those said items. No matter how many times the game wipes, they will always be there, but you can lose them in raids just like any other items. You cannot purchase multiple game editions. If you were to purchase multiple game editions, I believe it will only let you use the one with the highest value. So starting off with the care package bundle, you will be getting 100,000 Karunas, a second gun room, enough powder and shells to make 50 rounds of ammo, two food items, two water bottles, two NRS, two tier one knives, two pump shotguns, 40 shotgun shells, three tier two armors, and one backpack. This package comes in at about $5. I would say that this bundle probably is not worth it. These items only last you a couple of raids and then you'll be back to square one. Next up, the join or die bundle costs $10 and here's what you're gonna get. Your 100,000 Karunas, Additional bunker access to the intel room, enough gunpowder and shells to make 50 rounds of ammo, two food items, two water bottles, two nerds, two tier 1 knives, one tier 2 armor, one tier 3 armor, two backpacks, one Glock and PM, and you're going to get two magazines each for those, one M4 and one AK Alpha, two of each of their mags, two frag grenades, and one optic rail attachment for AK. It is definitely worth noting that all of these are on top of the benefits you would receive from the care package edition. I would definitely say that this edition is worth the buy without a doubt. Last but definitely not least comes in the nuclear night bundle. This comes in at $15 and here's what you're going to get on top of everything else we've already discussed. Level 2 traders, another 200,000 karunas, a potentially future gun skin, access to the shooting range, enough powder and shells to make 100 rounds of ammo, stun grenade, two pieces, two food items, two water bottles, two nerds, two tier one knives, one pump shotgun, 20 shotgun shells, four tier two armor, two tier three armor, two gear tech backpacks, one mp5 and uzi, two of each of their magazines, one Glock and PM, two of each of their magazines, one M4 and one AK Alpha, two of each of their magazines, two frag grenades, and one optic and rail attachment for the AK. This edition is definitely also worth it due to its long lasting benefits. One thing I forgot to touch on is while some of them contain additional access to bunker rooms, it's not that you can't access these without the additions, you just have to pay Karunas to gain access to them. Getting the additions allows you to have access to them immediately upon wipe. So, which one should you buy? I would definitely say you should save up and get the Nuclear Knight bundle almost 100% of the time. It's simply worth all the money you pay on it, and you'll eventually upgrade to it one day, probably. Anyway, that's going to do it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. You can ask me any questions you have in the comments. Hopefully I cleared up your confusions. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.